Hey everybody, um, this is Rainer. Um, I'm just going to show you how to update a mod that might be out of date. For uh, Let's see, for example, we got this old mod that I made. And it's for version 1.06 of the game. This was released back in August, I think. And the problem is... Um, the current version of the game now is 1.07.1. .1. When a game gets updated, a lot of things get thrown out of place, um, especially regulations and params. So, for example, um, if I'm using Mod Engine and I get this mod shot, let's just copy that and put it in Mod Engine. Um, if you're new to modding, you're probably using the mod folder in Mod Engine, so we're just going to do that so you can follow along with what I'm doing. Um, and let's launch the game and see what happens. So this mod that I made a while ago, um, edits all of your fist attacks and it increases the damage of barehanded fist attacks and just makes it a more useful thing um, to use in the game just because playing barehanded tends to not work. Um, it's not a viable strategy to play the game. So what we'll do is I'm going to show you what happens if I try to play this game barehanded without updating the mod. So let's look for some enemies. I believe it's misbegotten in here. There's one right there. Three damage. So there's something wrong with this mod. Um, thankfully, updating a mod is not that big of a deal. We're gonna go we're going to use something called Map Studio. You can get this in server name. Um, I'll link it down below in the description. Um, it's a very useful tool for editing parameters and can do so much more than that. I prefer it a lot more than Yapt, which is a bit outdated at this point, which is understating it. So you're new to Map Studio. Let's go to File, New Project. And let's just give it the name of the project, um, the name of the mod that we're working with. So we're just going to call it FIS. Um, let's go to project directory. We're going to go to your mod engine folder where you have the mod. And it's going to be the same folder that has your regulations. So right here, let's select that folder, game executable, click this. I'm going to go to game and select the executable. Load default load names. That's fine. Okay, now let's go to param editor. These are all your parameters, and one of the first things you're going to see in a bright green text is upgrade params. That's because Map Studio already knows that your mod is out of date. And this, let's just click that. It's going to say your mod is on regulation version 1.06 while your game is on version 1.07.1. .1. It's going to ask you if you want to upgrade. So just keep in mind, read these carefully because you might miss some steps. Click OK. What it's asking me to do is show Map Studio the vanilla 1.06 regulation file that hasn't been messed with at all. It needs to know this and luckily I keep it backed up here. It's also in the server. Map Studio needs to know this so that it can carry over the changes that were made in 1.06 over to your new vanilla regulation. Um, it's not going to edit your actual vanilla file, it's just going to edit your mod regulation. But anyway, let's go to Elevine 1.06 regulation, open it, 
and it'll say Map Studio can automatically perform several edits. This is what we want to do. So let's click yes. It's going to tell us everything it did. Click OK. We're almost done. Don't close the program yet. So go to File, Save Params. And now you're done. So close it and open that mod again. And let's see if it works. Oh shit. There we go, 100 damage. So now the mod's working. 